man. Can you give us any hints or tips on how to become, you know, I guess, better marketers of our products and everything, man? Uh, it's simple, man. Uh, first, first, marketing, it's kind of a trick, but the most people don't know what the trick is. Hey, please uh, inform us. Yeah, so the trick is to, at first, know what you're selling. Okay, and every time I got a new client, I explain Coca Cola is not selling black sugar water, they're selling happiness, right? Mm. So, for instance, if you got a dance school and you pretend that you're selling dance steps, I can guarantee you that the guy around the corner that stands that sells happiness or familiarity or uh, get you into a social environment, that guy will sell out the classes and you won't. Okay. Because people don't get in for your dance steps. I can guarantee you that. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. So, yeah, so wait, let me ask you this then. Um, I guess, how do you, how does one sell happiness or sell, you know, a social environment or familiarity? How do, how do you go about that? You have to ask yourself, okay, uh, people, everybody, uh, has five senses, right? So you can see, you can hear, you can feel, you can taste, and you can... See, touch, hear, smell, taste. Smell, 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 smell was the okay. word. Yeah, smell. <laughs> so actually, when, when, when you are talking about happiness, you can, you can ask yourself, Whenever I think about happiness, how am I feeling? Okay. Whenever I think about happiness, what I'm smelling, when I'm thinking about happiness, what I'm hearing, mm. when I'm thinking about happiness, what I'm seeing. And the only thing you have to do is uh, wrap your product in those things that you see, hear, smell, touch, feel. That's it. Yeah. It sounds very, very simple now, but at the end of the day, uh, I can give you a seminar and charge you $3,000 <laughs> for it, but I will just give you more examples so you can understand it. Now. Please, please. No, but, but, but at the end of the day, it's simple. You have to... People react. The most decisions, even if they tell you it, it's not like that, is based on emotions, right? Mm, right, I, I believe that. And emotions are triggered by your senses. There is no way um, other. It, it, it's only triggered by your five senses you got. Okay? Uh, even the sixth sense people talk about, it's a combination of your five senses. Yeah, right. right. That makes sense. You get it? So you have to trigger those five, those five senses senses in a way or another and uh, then you got clients man and ask yourself okay at least when you start putting out your product out there you ask to out ask yourself what am i looking for uh, what are my who are my clients what are their problems how can i fix that for them and how will people feel at the end, when they consume my product, yeah. so you know lace, lace like in the chips. Oh, the chips, yeah, definitely, yeah, yeah. Yes, man. Okay, those guys actually are giving you fried potatoes, right? It's that's <laughs> it's, all it is. <laughs> it's it's not a difficult product, it's just fried potatoes. But these guys invest a lot of money. How the sound of the package. Is mm. when you open it up. I can guarantee you can open up a million packages of lace. It will sound on every corner of the world the same. Okay, okay. Exactly the same. Because actually they just want you to open up a pack and have the feeling that you had the chips in your mouth. Mm. You get it? Yeah. That's it, man. Uh, and again... Um, I cannot give you everything in 15 minutes, 
but if you can trigger all those five senses, uh, people will keep coming back, right? 